Hey guys, welcome back to Mr. Gamer. Today we'll talk about Zachary Levi. Who will Alex choose? Let's head into it. Alex. Alex's light blonde hair is tied back into high twin tails with gentle pink ribbons. She donned a soft pink and white jacket with linked white gloves, a fuchsia skirt, white knee-high socks, and fuchsia boots in her prior role. She's dressed in a soft pink and white jacket, laced white gloves, a pink shirt with a pink bow on her chest, a pink shirt with a pink bow on her chest, a fuchsia skirt with white stripes, white knee-high stockings, and fuchsia Mary Janes for her new appearance. Her almond-shaped hazel gold eyes are hazel gold. To her other squad members, Alex is usually very nice enthusiastic, happy, and outgoing. This is particularly obvious when she interacts with the senior squad members as well as the newer squad members, Levi and Luca. Alex is also tolerant, not chastising but confused, by her companion's odd behavior. Alex is quite feminine, unlike her tomboy friend Jade and her in-love pal Charlie. Alex had a haughty demeanor. She may be seen in numerous of her films, refusing to perform anything that will impair her appearance. Zach. Her boyfriend is Zachary Todd, who she started dating in 2017. They also run a channel named Zalex Together. However, it's presently inactive. The couple appears to be in a blissful and loving relationship. They spend a lot of time together and post pictures to their social media profiles. On the other hand, Alex has turned down Zach's marriage proposal, but why is that the case? Why she chose against marriage? It's easy to believe that marriage is a social good in today's America, that more individuals marrying and staying married enhances our lives and communities. Marriage, of course, has changed dramatically in recent generations, causing the occasional cultural commentator to wonder if it is becoming outmoded. Only a handful of these individuals, though, appear to be really interested in the answer. The issue is frequently used as a rhetorical device to provide provoke moral panic over evolving family values, or to speculate on whether society has become too cynical for love. Marriage offers happiness, divorce brings loneliness, and never marrying is a fundamental failing of belonging. According to popular culture, for me, this is both a personal and societal and political issue. When my partner Kate and I talk about whether or not we want to marry, our friends assume we're debating whether or not we're serious about our relationship, but it's not my connection that I'm doubting, it's the institution as a whole. Despite the fact that marriage is frequently seen as a vital component of a happy existence, the Pew Research Center estimates that only half of all Americans over the age of 18 are married. This compares to the prior record of 72% in 1960. People are marrying later in life, on average and they were just a few decades ago, which is one clear cause for this transition. In 2018, the median age for first marriage in the US was 30 for males and 28 for women, an all-time high. While most Americans anticipate to marry at some point in their life, 14% of never married adults say they have no plans to marry at all, and another 27% are unclear if marriage is appropriate for them. When individuals mourn the demise of marriage, data like these are regularly coded. True, marriage isn't as popular as it once was, but Americans still marry and divorce at a higher rate than the vast majority of other Western countries. Alex opted out of marriage, preferring to remain single since she was afraid of divorcing Zach if she married him. Levi Levi is a black man with black hair and black eyes, a black cap sleeve jacket over a white colored polo shirt, a black button up top, black pants, and black boots make up his ensemble. His arms are covered in typical white bandages, and he wears a black jacket fastened around his waist. Levi's voice is ideally suited to his attitude, as he is sullen, annoyed by the other members of the squad, dislikes bright colors and spreading love, and even owns an edgy stallion. Despite this, Levi can be nice, as proven by his concern for his closest friends in Among Us. And on Princess Alex, Alex's second channel. During Among Us meetings, Levi is also shown to be the most logical. Levi normally keeps his cool, but when other members make comments about him being bald or a dumb goose, he loses it. He's also not a jokester, as he despises having to put up with the other squad members' shenanigans. Online relationship. They're dating, but it's only a virtual affair. What a nightmare. I'd like to think of myself as a contemporary renaissance man. Nancy Drew it is, because I'm a sucker for a good internet mystery. The excitement of discovering something new through a Google search. Fear clutches my esophagus as I wait to check if an Instagram account has been made private. The rush of discovering you were correct all along. When you see a like on Twitter, perhaps the most authentic kind of modern romanticism is the legs to which people will go on the internet to discover more about a crush. I'll show you how to tell if someone is dating someone online. Because I've suffered with too much internet research, take everything I've said with a grain of salt. So it's either a relationship that's not good enough for marriage, or 
or a fake online relationship. I bet Alex will choose neither of both. What do you think about Alex? Should she choose Zack or Levi? Let us know in the comment section. This brings us to the end of our video. I hope you enjoyed it. Hit like if you did. And don't forget to subscribe to our channel so that you don't miss any of our videos in the future. Also, watch the two videos that are on your screen because I'm sure you'll love them. With that, I'll see you in the next video.